Welcome back guys and today is another kids coding playground video and today we will be doing another special uh, one of the special series videos so today we will be working on a project called the happy birthday card it's featuring projects for kids like you you can send projects to us and then we can teach you a tutorial in our channel we will also give you details on how to submit your project later, so then you can give it to us and we can make a small tutorial. Today we will be featuring a project my little cousin did named Jalen. He he started Scratch following our channel last week, so then we so he made a happy birthday card for me. I am ver very proud of him, so he did a really good job. So let's jump into the video. So, we will be learning these following concepts in the, this is our first video of featuring projects from Kids Like You series. So, this is the birthday card my cousin Jalen made for me. We are learning these concepts in Scratch, repeat until, hide slash show, play sound. It should be really easy for beginners. And, yes. So, it's like about this, so I put an underscore for whatever name you could put there. So the words change colors and the balloons pop, and then it's playing the birthday sound. And there's a party background. So the balloons will pop when they get up there, and then after when the song ends, the candles will be blown out on the cake. So, Let's jump right into it. Let's start with the cake. So if the flag is clicked, it'll switch the costume to cake A. A play sound birthday, that's making the sound. Switch costume to cake B, because there's two costumes for the cake, the one with the candles and one without the candles. Now let's move on to sprite one, which is basically happy birthday sprite. We'll repeat eight times, change color effect by 25, and I'll wait one second. And the balloon code. So if flag clicked, it'll show. That means you can see it. It'll set X to negative 186. Set Y to negative 38. Yeah, it'll show in the beginning. So it'll repeat 90 times. Change Y by two. If Y position is more than 130, then it'll start the sound pop and it'll hide. So the repeat 90 is for like if it's like right here that means it'll keep on moving up so that's repeat 90 times that's 90 times so if it's lower if it's lower it'll repeat more if it's higher it'll repeat less so that's what it basically means so there's a lot of ways you can do this and there's another way that's easier than repeating 90 times in the y position things Yes, yes, yes. We will work on that when we get to our project. So let's make a new project. Let's start. So I zoomed in a little bit. Let's get the cake sprite. Let's get the sprites first, and then let's get the background. So let's get the cake sprite. And let's get the, the balloon sprite. We need three. Balloon me three, right there. So we need three balloons. We need to make a sprite. We need to paint a sprite. So we can do this text. Okay. Happy birthday. Underscore. So let's ch increase the size of this. It's a little bit too big. So I think we can minus some underscores so it isn't that big. Um, I think a little bigger will do it. So that's about the middle. Let's get our backdrop, the party backdrop. And let's start coding. So we gotta set the size 
to 200 before we start so then the cake is or bigger and then if start when the green flag is clicked it will switch costume to cake a because that's the one with the candles if you can see it better that's the one with the candles and then it will then it will so we'll be learning sounds so there's a birthday sound right here right here so let's take the sound play sound birthday until done and then switch costume to cake b because that's when it lights out the candles that's when someone blows out the candles so the happy birthday name this thing so we can rename it to birthday name yeah, and then we can, if flag clicked, it will repeat eight times. Eight is a fine number because, and it will change color effect. So it will change color effect eight times, basically. And it will keep on blinking. So wait one second. So it will have a recoil before it goes again or else it'll blink way too quickly. Let's move on to the balloon. We're almost there. So the balloon. So we can change the costumes of some balloons. So let's work on this one. So let's, if flag clicked, let's zoom out one. See if you can still see that. So there's another way to do this. We can show. So when I said the set X, the set X and the set Y thing, you can use a go to. It's basically the same thing in two. And then. So let's drag this a little bit down because the go to is a little bit too up. We can change the size. Let's say about 60. That's about the right size. Um, so there's a, the other way that I was telling you. You can repeat until instead of using repeat 90 times because. You can you can always est you always have to estimate numbers, but you can do a repeat until touching edge, and then it'll change y by two, so slowly go up, and then it'll start the sound pop because it'll make the sound when it touches the edge, and then it will hide. So this is the same code for all of them. So we can, another way, you, you, you don't have to duplicate this, you can just drag it, and then it can go up to here too, and here. So let, let's change the size to 60. Again, we can also change the color as well. No, oh, wrong, 90. Uh, size is 60. So we can change the costumes. We can choose from this one to the purple one, this one to the uh, yellow one. We can move this one a little bit up, and this one a little bit, like right here. You can also do that. We can take out this one and bring that one in. And then you can take out this one and bring this one in. So let's see how it goes. As you can see, the happy birthday thing is changing and then the candles will light out. And then the, the song ended and then the balloons popped. So that's the end of our video, guys. And please like, subscribe, and share. And if you enjoyed the video, then like, subscribe, and share. And have a good day.